Good afternoon, YouTube. In this video, I will be talking about a really amazing feature of the Amazon Kindle update for Paperwhite 3 from 2015. This is the Generation 7. What's so great? What's so great is when Amazon released this update, they gave a new feature for the Kindle that allows it to function similar to a Windows PC. I'll show you what I mean. Before I begin, I want you to know that I actually did this update manually. So what that means is using my data cable, I downloaded the update into my laptop and then I transferred it via cable into my Kindle because I want my Kindle to remain in airplane mode. You can update uh, over Wi-Fi directly from the Kindle. That's also an option. You need to get to the advanced options menu and I'll, I'll take you there from the start. All right, so to update your Paperwhite 3 Generation 7 2015 Kindle, you need to first go to settings. Then tap on all settings. After all settings, you're gonna to go to device options. After device options, we need to go to advanced options on the bottom. Second up to the top, it's not highlighted, but you can read update your Kindle. And this is where you update it, whether over the air wirelessly or from your computer. So let me just quickly show you what this new feature is. When you have files, you can create shortcuts and put those shortcuts on your desktop. Uh, you can also organize your files by putting them into folders. And that is what this new feature is right down here. Create new collection. So a collection is basically a, a file folder where you can put shortcuts of your favorite books into various folders that they call collections. So for this video, I will speak with Amazon terminology and just call it collection, but it's really a folder slash shortcut. This is what I'm talking about. All right, so here's my fitness folder, okay? No, 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 okay, here we go. Books for fun. This is titled Books for Fun, and there's a number on the bottom, 12. And on the top, there is a icon of a folder. So that kind of tells you what this is. It's a folder of files. How many files? There are 12. So let's tap on that. When um, I did a long tap, I did not do a quick tap. So when you long tap on the folder, it allows you to add, remove the books inside of it. You can rename the collection name or the folder name. You can remove the folder from the device and I believe it would not delete the books inside. Let's exit out of that. Now let's tap on books for fun. So here are my books for fun. Uh, we have a uh, Losing My Virginity from Richard Branson, his um, his entrepreneurial book. Uh, we have Folk Tales of the Maldives, Vega Bonding, lots of really, really awesome books. Spider-Man, bus Business Backpacker Business. All right, so these are all my books. How did they get here? Let me show you. Let's go back to home. Now, the three dots in the upper right hand corner below the time, that's your options, your quick menu options. Go to the bottom and you're gonna find two new options. We have view special offers and we have create new collection. To make a folder or a new collection, we tap on the bottom and we can call this Fun Reads 2. Because I already have a folder like this, but maybe I want 
a different collection of, of books that are fun to read. Maybe something for, for my friends, uh, for my family, uh, for kids, you know. Okay, so we just made that, that name of a folder. And in the next screen, it has all the books that I have with a box at the end. To add a shortcut to one of these into your collections folder, simply just tap on the box. When you're finished, click done. Now if we go to our folder, Fun Reads 2, I have those books in here. Okay, now this is where it gets even more awesome. Look at this book right here. How to turn $100 into $1 million. Okay, so this book, let's, let's go back. This book is in my Fun Reads 2. But if you go to my investing and making money folder, how to turn $100 into $1 million. Whoa, it's here too. So this is why I said it's like a shortcut, right? Um, the, as, as you read this book, like let's say I'm 70% finished with this book. Well, that status bar is going to show in both folders. In, in my Fun Reads 2 folder and in my Investing and Making Money folder. This is a great feature um, that Amazon put in because sometimes books that you read, they're fun, but at the same time, they might have information that you like. So when I have books, uh, investing is really important to me, but you know, I have fun reading some of those investment books, not all of them, some of them. And having shortcuts to both of them in two separate folders is a great way to organize. And there you have it. Uh, this is that feature that I want to show you uh, about. I'm not sure if any of these are different. I haven't explored. I just wanted to make a video explaining about the new collection. Um, if your tablet is, um, is rooted, is hacked, uh, definitely you should know that if you want to unhack your Kindle, get the update and then go back to hack it again, that hack, that routing of your Kindle will not work. Uh, this is a new version. That's a new firmware. And so that hack is not going to work. Um, you'll have to wait for another uh, update for, um, for how to root your Kindle. All right, everybody. Hope you enjoy the video. And if you have any questions, please ask in the comments below.